What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Logs back, and yes, guys, we are back with another stuff making video. And today, before actually no, before I get into the video, you know what to do: drop 10k, like the video, sub down below, comment 10k in the comments to have a chance at winning 10k. I will pick a random person, a random comment to win 10k. If the video hits 30 likes, guys, 30 likes is not a lot. I've done it many times. My stub making method videos are popping. The supporters are fire. So let's get into it. We're doing gold edition today. Yes, gold edition. I'm going to show you all the golds. And yes, the market is down a lot. But let's get into it. We're going to start with some golds. We did silver and bronze edition. If you guys are interested in making stubs of silver and bronze, go check out my other videos. But let's get into it. Okay. So my recommendations right now the auction is crashing and right now you can make mad stops with the market crash because everybody is pulling packs and the sell nows are whack and right now is the best time to make your stubs so right now you could do all that you could honestly i'm not even gonna say you could pull not what am i saying i can't speak on the sell nows you could put a buy now order for 1360 like that I'm gonna actually do it and hold on to him, especially for cards with no inside edge or down inside edge. So I'm putting a thing on him. The price gap's good. And not only is the price gap big, but I'm gonna hold on to Nelson Cruz. I'm gonna use him and I'm gonna hold on to him because the market crash, market's down. He was like 2300 yesterday with the inside edge up. Even with the inside edge, even. He was at 2300. He dropped 600 stubs. That's a big price down. And the sell now is way low. It's so low. His stats are very good. So, that's a good one right there. Let's keep going. Tony Sip, no. You want to go for... You want to really pay attention to active players. So, Robinson Cano is down as well. Even though his inside edge is up. So, you could pick up this card for 11 999 $11 And you can make stubs. You can hold on to it if you want. Because... Oh, hey, look. I already... Honestly, yo, I'm just going to sell... Uh, no, I'm not. I'm going to hold on to him. So right there, make stubs. I'll make stubs quick. I'll make a quick 300 or 200 after reduction. If I hold on to them, I'll make 600 after reduction. So let's keep going. Okay, Eugenio Suarez, one of the Reds' top players besides Votto. He's in a collect. He's good for the collection. So what you want to do is pick him up for 1358 and hold and sell him. I mean, not sell him. You can keep. You can sell him, make a little bit of stubs, but you should hold on to him. Uh, we got Dave Peralta over her. David Robertson. Clevenger, all these guys right now are super cheap. If you would drop a one, you have you could blah, you could drop a minimum sell now of 1k. They're all gonna go up in value. I would say at least a minimum of 100 stubs. You could all make profit off these cards if you just wait a little bit. Right now, I'm telling you, this is the best. And if you guys don't believe me, my team is pretty stacked. I have to do this every video because I'm a low, I'm a, I'm a low account. My team's pretty good. It's not the best, but it's pretty, pretty, pretty good. And my pitting, this is where my stubs are right here. It's all in the pitching, man. I would not sell your team. I'm just saying, do not sell your team. And guys, do not pop these packs. Don't. I popped three, and I got doo, doo Got three, two silvers, and one crap gold Carlos Correa for 1K. So do not pop those packs. All right, let's go back to it. Sorry for my nonsense. Okay. Roberto Ozuna 1k right there. You make quick stubs that way. Hold on to them all these cars I'm just gonna say hold on to because the auction is dying. It's not a good time to sell. It's a good time to buy It's like when when gold is low you want to buy gold when gold goes high you sell it high It's the same exact concept with this game. It's very interesting, but What else I'm gonna say? It also has a lot to do with performances We'll get into that in another video, but let's just I'm gonna say it quickly Let's say Ben Tenney goes off today and he's at 1K. He will literally go off a 1K. So let's say you have Jose Abreu. He's versing a lefty that isn't good in the MLB. You think he's going to go off? I would pick him up and I would sell him right. I would pick him up and wait to see how he performs. If he goes off, you're going to see at about 8. No, let's say he plays at 8 o'clock. At 10 o'clock, his price is going to be at his top price. It's all based on performance. As you can see, Cody Bellinger went up mad since he's gold. But they didn't drop a freaking roster update. I don't know why. Maybe they're going to drop it tomorrow. Maybe next week. I don't know what's going on with the all-star update. But it's BS. Marcelo Zuna picking this up. Awesome, 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 awesome gap right here. I'm going to hold on to him. 
very very good price gap right there the price gaps is where you make all your stubs this is a good price gap as well i already have Puig. But he's gonna go. No, I don't even know if he's gonna go up in price. Oh, this is a good one. Oh, wait. It's not an active card. Bumgarner right there. That's a pretty good one. 1K quick. I'm actually gonna sell mine right now. I don't know about what am I saying. So, everyone, just hold on to your cards and listen to your boy Bugs. He knows what he's talking about. Guys, this Babe Ruth card's dirty. I'm gonna have to pick him up. Does he play first base? No, only right field. Get out of here. I need a first baseman. Okay. Any recommendations for a first baseman? Sorry for that spit. Ew. So any recommendations for a first baseman, please hit me up in the comments down below. I, I, I'm going to get more stubs. I can spend 20k on a first baseman easily. Hit me up in the comments, any recommendations. And guys, if you guys want to see a gameplay, let me know. Okay, Donaldson, very good price gap. I'm entering it. 25.05. Quick price gap. Make quick stubs. But I would hold on to him. Honestly, yeah, everyone's just going down. Correa was literally 3k. He's 1800. I pulled that piece of crap and I sold him right away because I was so triggered. I just I just quick sold him. Cause come on, dude. Why is the auction so low? Whit Merrifield, 2200. That's a snag. That's a snag right there. I would pick him up. Oh my god, I already got overcut. Whatever. So Marcello Zuno, let's see. Donaldson. Uh Walker Bueller's good. I honestly think he's gonna be a dime this year. He's been pitching lights out. Corbin, how is Corbin and gold? He's all right. Posey, oh, that's a that's a price gap right there. So twelve six two, nice price gap. Highly recommended. I would hold on to him. Maybe he's gonna turn into a diamond again, like last year. Blake Snell, man, been lights out, pitching gems. Oh my god, on the roster update, he should definitely be a diamond. He's a Cy Young, reigning Cy Young. No way, he's not a diamond, correct? No way. Stalin Marte is really low right now. I would pick him up, hold on to him. Trevor Story, nice price gap, make some quick stubs. I don't even have enough to enter it. Okuna's gonna be a diamond soon. He's finally heating up, doing unbelievable. JT Romuto, okay, his edge is down. I'm picking him up and I'm holding on to him. I'm telling you, this is this is one of the perfect cards for this. Oh my god, it's beautiful. This is one of the most perfect cards for this. Oh my god, his edge is down, the auction's down. It literally is beautiful. And he's one of the top catchers in the game. He's like a top 10. One of the best budget catchers in the game, easily. So, that's a very good card. I highly recommend that one. Lorenzo Cain's on a tear right now. Don't ask me how. He's been terrible the last couple seasons. Uh, let's see. Let's keep going. I'm in a video. Uh, we got Chad Green. No good. This one's good. You can make quick stubs off this. It's probably going to keep dropping. Uh, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Seager. Trey Turner. He's out. I lost like 3k stubs in this car because right when I bought him, he died. Yeah, he freaking died on me. But yes, very good card. You can make quick stubs of this one. I wouldn't even hold on to him. Don't buy this card. It's not worth it. Uh, let's see. We got Kimbrel. Not even on the team. Don't buy the card. I know. It's just, just don't buy it. That's all the golds, man. Really? That's it? I already went all over, all over those golds, guys. And guys, I really, I really hope you guys enjoy these stub making method videos. I really put a lot of time into these. They're, they're honestly, this is just how you make stubs. It's literally the best way to make stubs simply. And guys, all right, look, I already made that. I already got the Donaldson. So honestly, if you guys, if you guys have like 30k stubs, just keep doing this. You'll make mad stubs. I'm actually going to sell my Donaldson just because he's performing so bad. Performance has a lot to do with this game, okay? My bad. Oh, okay. Performance has a lot to do with this game. It's not just fibbling and selling. You also have to, like, you have to realize how people are performing. Like, it makes, and you really need to, like, you need to watch that. You kind of have to watch baseball play this game, which is very cool. Huge, huge baseball fan in general and a Mets fan. But, guys, believe me, these stub making methods work. Sometimes they take a little time consuming. But, like I said, post, like, 10. Let's say you post 10 of these. And then you go into a game, you get XP in a game, you get stubs in a game, and you get a card after the game. So right there, it's like 500 stubs. Then you come back on here, whatever cards you got, you quickly sell and you make stubs. That simple. And honestly, guys, that's all I got for you today. I hope you guys enjoyed these stub making best videos. And honestly, stay blessed and peace out, everybody. Peace. Hey, yo,